Hello friends, uh, I hope you all are well and safe. Now today we are going to discuss about one important issue that is related to transferring files from Android to a Mac. Right friends, transferring files from Mac to uh, Android I have already told you but from Android to Mac it's, it's pretty much not easy and you might want to send these files wirelessly as well because you might not like these cables to transfer the files from Android to MacBook. So friends, in this video, I'm going to tell you how you can send the files from Android to MacBook wirelessly and without of any kind of you know need of any wires or something to transfer the files. So let's get started and we'll tell you how what we can do it. So friends, here I'm using a very old phone just to showcase you this trick even works for old phones. So what all you need to do is you need to go to Play Store and install one application and that application will do nothing but it will actually provide you a file manager application through which we can transfer files between Android and Mac. And now while you are installing this application if in case you are not able to find this application I'm just telling you the name. So the name is EX file manager and if in case still you are not able to find it in Play Store what you all need to do is you need to go to this i button over here and click install so that it's a direct link to this application okay so now once you have installed this application click open and allow all the permissions that it requires okay after allowing all the permissions you will see this menu button over here or you can see here so this kind of menu you will be able to see in your phone okay after clicking this menu button you will see a lot of options on the left hand side so what all you need to do is you need to go to network and cloud which is over here and it's written as transfer to PC option so click transfer to PC and now you will see a option web server not running shared path username password and start okay so now you need to click start and there will be a link for FTP with the IP address. So friends, if in case you don't know about it, I'm just going to tell you what all it is. So it's a file transfer protocol, which is now generated on my phone, which is currently acting as a server. And the IP address to access that server is 192.168.1.7.2211. Okay, if in case anyone on this Wi-Fi network, so most important part is the Wi-Fi network that you have currently connected to, okay? The person who is connected to this Wi-Fi network can now access the files from this particular phone over this HTTP address. Now we need to go in our MacBook and hit this particular IP address and open the page to get files from my Android phone. So let's get into the laptop. First of all, this trick will only work if in case your laptop has a Google Chrome because uh, the Safari directly hits a FTP connection as a, a total FTP connection because of which it does not uh, able to actually connect to your phone. So I would suggest to go for a Google Chrome and write FTP, this web address, whatever is showing in your phone that is 192.168.1.7211 as you can see friends now i have a list of uh, all the folders in my phone i will just zoom in for you so that you can you will be able to see it so as you can see friends here is a complete index of all the items that is there in my phone and now if in case I want to go to uh, DCIM camera and want to access some kind of uh, photo, I'm j I can just go through over there. It will take some time to load and I can easily access all the files from here. So suppose um, I want to download one file that is this something.pdf and this PDF can now easily be downloaded. I can just zoom in so that you will be able to see in, in a proper way. So now I need to download this file. I need just need to click this one and you can say 
it is currently getting downloaded and it's currently downloaded. I can just click and open it and it will get open. So this is the way friends, what we can do to download these files. It's very easy, very quick. You can easily transfer files between the two Android and Mac. Hope this video was useful for you and you will be able to transfer files between Android and MacBook. Thank you.